Well, today we're gonna to get into one of the stages of the five elements of defense, and this is the rolling shoulder. The Philly shell has gained recognition and prominence in the Midwest, starting with James Lights Out Tony, Bo Jack, Floyd Mayweather, Bernard Hawkins out in Philadelphia. This is a prolific layer of your defense. And in the defensive onslaught of fighters, your objective is to have solid, profound defense. So we've created what we call the five layers of defense. The five layers of defense tells you and explains each component of defense that it takes to build a complete fighter. Layer one, feet. Layer two, elbows. Layer three, shoulders hands, objective is using all of these components to elevate your defense and to be able to shut your opponent down. Then you add your counter punching. So today we're gonna get into the box. My version of the Philly shell, the rolling shoulder is titled the box. Now learning these layers on the five layers of defense, all of these elements are essential when it comes down to becoming a pugilist at your fight game. We take the time and we put the time in daily. Make sure our athletes go into the ring fully equipped for battle. So remember that rolling shoulder is just one element of the four corners defense. That's why we call it the box. With that, you can overcome any situation. Stay composed, breathe, relax, put the reps in, and stay conditioned. This is The Box by Master Boxing, where you'll get your master's degree in boxing. Make sure you get that footwork down packed because those things will also make the difference whenever you're an elite athlete and you're going from level to level. My name is Coach Eric Bradley, and I thank you guys for taking the time out to take your game to the next level. This was The Box. See you on the other side in the winner's circle. Peace. Roll, drop, right foot, left foot. And get right here, like this. Watch you about to throw it. Tenacious up the Throw it up the Get that heel off the ground. Step around, back to position. Catch the jab. Roll the right hand. Bend. Step with the right. Up. Step back. Catch. Here. Bend. Step. Up. Step back in position. Catch. Roll. Step. Stay in position. We're going to do it now. We're going to catch, roll, bend, step. Ready? Catch, roll, bend, step. Back in position. Catch, roll, bend, step. Back in position. No uppercut this time. Catch, roll, bend. Back in position. Catch, roll, bend. Back. Make that bend, that hop with conviction. Catch, roll, bend. Step around. Back. You don't look deep. Look like you're about to fight for a fucking title. Catch, roll, bend. Step. Back. Catch, roll, bend. Step. Catch, roll, bend, step. Catch, roll, bend, step. Catch, roll, bend, step. Catch, roll, bend, step. 
And if you're dropping and rolling, like I think I see you doing, you're, you're doing a disservice. You have to learn to get from here to there. So what you're doing is cheating. You're cheating on your opponent. Step right here, Puck. See, if Puck's right here, and I'm throwing shots, and I'm trying to bend and get over, if I pivot right here, Puck beats me up, right? But if I throw here, and I bend here, and I step here, start to see key thing, some fighters are born with natural power, natural speed, natural ability. You have to obtain and you have to contain that. And you have to let them know what the mid gods want to see, which is constant balance in the mind and in the body. Positioning is much, much, much more essential than one thinks to knowledge. But the key is never allowing the fighter to fight like he wants to fight and allow him to fight like it's necessary to fight. Pull back on all that aggression, pull back on all that speed, and then it starts to build like a baby from the ground up. Good. Good. Now we're gonna come back. 
come here, same thing on the other side, same thing. the ropes and you have to get yourself out of that situation run this drill with your fighters and fighters listen to your coaches or consistently use this drill we're going to get the blocks so we're going to block here 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 and here. left to right up mm -hmm. your elbow is going to stop that ain't nothing get there so why you throw It's not a perfect example of your objective is bing, 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 bing. And when you drop, everything comes with it. Pop, the shoulder goes up, pop, because it can faint and come right here. So remember that. Walk through the drill slow. Wherever he is, whatever I hand. Ready? And. That's how you handle a fighter whenever he's pressing you on the ropes and you're in the shell. You use it and turn his offense against him, and then you counter him with your offense behind that box. Listen.